Dear Emily, I sit here today fully prepared and ready to call you my wife. Marriage isn't something for the faint of heart, but it's something that I've never been more confident in. The last few months have been a whirlwind. Wedding planning isn't the easiest, but even in the stressful times, you remind me every day why I fell in love with you in the first place. There is no doubt in my mind that you are the man I was meant to spend the rest of my life with. When I think of our future together, I'm overjoyed with the thoughts of what that will look like. I will honor and love you all the days of our lives. You have been the single best and greatest person to have ever walked into my life. I could have not asked for a more loving and caring man to spend the rest of my life with. So Emily Baum, soon to be Emily Walter, I promise to protect you. I promise to be there when you need it. I promise to love you during the good times and the bad times and I promise to cherish and appreciate you forever. I love you and am ready to honor you for all the days of my life. For as much as Matthew and Emily have consented together in marriage and have declared the same before God and this group here, I now pronounce them husband and wife in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Matthew, you may kiss your bride. Thank you from Rich and I for all of you being here to get tonight together with us to celebrate Mr. and Mrs. Walter. Congratulations, Matthew and Emily. We love you and we're so very happy for you. I've loved watching you guys just become a couple and, and I look forward to this day for way before you guys got engaged last April. So. Here's to a championship this season in volleyball, but also here's to years of happiness. Cheers. Emily, you may be a piece of work sometimes, but you are one of my best friends and I wish you two all of the happiness in the world. Now let's raise a glass to the happy couple, as well as to the knowledge that they will have a spare bedroom at their place should I require my supple backup plan in a couple years. Holding you to it. for the toughest sharing of all, sending my best friend off on his happily ever after. And just the more I've gotten to know Emily, the better I feel about that. 
And so tomorrow, when I head off to Arrowhead, and these two get packed up to head off to Hawaii, all I'll be able to do is smile, because I'm happy to share them. People don't write poetry about a perfect life. There's something beautiful about you and I. Let the people in this room be a reminder of how many people are praying for you, ready to babysit a nugget or a pup in a moment's notice, and of course, ready to go on a trip when you need some getaway pals. I love you both so much. Let's raise a glass to a lifetime of love for Emily and Walt. Cheers to chicken. Yeah. <laughs>